definition. Opening night coming up next, only on Fox Footy. Do you remember the moment you fell in love with Australian rules football? Do you remember that first game you watched on television? Our game has evolved over the years and we have all been witness to it. Television has been there for almost 60 years. It has given us images that will stay with us forever. Memories that will stand the test of time. It has connected the millions of fans to its biggest names. And there's been none bigger in the game than Ronald Dale Barassi. The footy field where our great game, Australian Rules Football, has been played for more than 150 years. It's changed a fair bit over the years. New teams, new stadiums, new rules. But it's still the greatest game in the world. Our game is defined by moments. Moments that we'll never forget. Moments that make a legend. Moments that inspire us. Moments that have made grown men cry. And moments that have been more and more as every season passes. Here it is! Every year, this game produces moments like these, and it will continue to do so for many, many more. But it's not just moments on the field that we remember. Moments that shape the game happen off the field, and can be just as significant. For sheer impact on the public psyche, Football Australian style sits on a plane of its own. I've covered this game for more than 40 years, and I've chased a lot of stories in that time. Caught a couple too. When Ron Barassi left Melbourne after the 64 Premiership win to go to Carlton, the game went into a state of shock. In fact, the state of Victoria went into a state of shock. At the time, it was like the Pope declaring he had defected to the Church of England. It was unacceptable to me that I could work with men who wouldn't back The SAC coach has long provided football with its most dramatic headlines. Oh, of course, okay, you that. Okay. The Wayne Carey scandal rocked the football world in 2002 and prompted an unprecedented level of media coverage. I believe this is the only proper and responsible course of action. Thank you. With television, radio, newspapers, internet and social media, it's hard to believe just how big this game is. But after the story has been written, the game is and always has been about the players, the modern day gladiators of our sport. They are the biggest stars in town. The players' rooms, where more than 12,000 players who've played this game at the highest level have prepared for action. Football's been a part of my life for as long as I can remember. Growing up, I was glued to the TV, watching some of the game's greatest ever players. and I've been lucky enough to play with and against the modern day superstars. Imagine being able to watch more of yesterday's champions in action. Witten, Nichols, Baldock and Farmer. But there just wasn't the level of coverage then as there is today. We live in an age where every game is covered. So every memorable mark, every freakish goal and every match winning moment can be replayed and remembered forever in a day. The coverage of our game has come a long way since the 1950s. I've been lucky to call many games of football from here, and I suppose some of the game's great moments. And the main players have done it. The last time was 1953. 
It's the caller's job to accurately describe the game to the viewers and to entertain them. Sometimes it's the commentary that makes the moment even more special. To the weak position on the member's hand side. Oh, just a weak goal! You're guilty! Football broadcasting has, of course, changed a lot over the years. In my time, we had just three cameras covering the big games. Nowadays, there's up to 50 cameras covering the biggest matches. So now, tonight, we launch a 24-hour football channel. Who would ever have thought it? It's a whole new era of football on television, and the era begins right now. Over to a maestro, Eddie Maguire. Thanks, Tony. Fox footy is here and we're ready to go. I tell you what, we can't wait for this to begin. It's going to be bigger and better than ever. The biggest moments will happen right here live. The biggest stories in the game will unfold right here. And the biggest stars in the game will perform for you right here. Fox footy, it's your team, your game, your channel. Let's get cracking. Welcome to Fox Footy, and what a big 115 years it's been in football. Welcome, everybody, to the start of a new era in the greatest game in the world, as Fox Footy brings you every game, live, uninterrupted, siren to siren, in brilliant high definition and with IQ. Welcome to our team, welcome to our family, welcome to the biggest revolution in sport we've seen in Australia. Ladies and gentlemen, not only have we got the biggest names in the game watching and being part of the action on the ground, but we've got them calling in from the box as well. As I welcome my co-commentators co tonight, a man who actually holds the record in the NAB Cup or the secondary competition for goals kicked. 116 in the secondary competition, Jason Dunstall, a stalwart of Fox football, 116 to go with his 12.54 that he kicked in the big time. Welcome Jason Dunstall, everybody, one of the Thank stars. You, May I say, it is fantastic to have you on board. I'm not quite sure if you said Etihad Stadium or Etihad Stadium, <laughs> but nevertheless, you're part of a great team now, and we're on the verge of something special at Fox Footy. We're about to take the game to, to footy fans around the country as I've never seen it before. Every second of every match, new and innovative technology that no one's ever seen before. I'm genuinely excited tonight. It is. It's fantastic. It's like being a kid in the candy store, yep. ready to go again. After all the years we've been involved in it, there is just a feel around the place tonight that Fox Footy and the Fox Footy channel is back. So too is this man joining me for the first time on Fox Footy. We've done a lot of shows over the years, Dern, but I tell you what, this is exciting. The five-time day and five-time night champion of the Hawthorne Football Club, Dermot Brereton. Okay, we're the new kids on the block. Here we are. Really looking forward to tonight. I know it's the first hit out for the NAB Cup, and we see, I mean, it'll be the biggest day in the life of all these first game players, first year players out here tonight. But for the second and third year players, this is the chance when they get to say, How much have I improved? 
am I going to be a bona fide star? So big night for a lot of people out you there. You know it's big because Dermot is genuinely excited. This time, what, last week, he was with Snoop Dogg Dog at the Super Bowl. <laughs> so, you know, he, he mixes in the high circles. That's no, there's no doubt about it. Paul Roos, what about this guy? One of the greatest thinkers in the game. He was the bloke we saw in our intro there who finally brought South Melbourne and Sydney that long premiership. And he's here tonight, one of the greats from Fitzroy and Sydney Swans. And as I said, one of the masterminds of coaching. Paul Roos, welcome aboard, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, welcome to you, Eddie and Dermot. Welcome to the channel and good to see you again, Jake. Thanks, Let me put my coaching hat on, though, Eddie. Fantastic. No excuse now for those players out there not to watch nine games live. And if they don't, they can put on IQ. So for all the coaches and all the players, this is fantastic. Can they spell IQ? That's the problem. <laughs> it doesn't matter now. It doesn't matter. Just push the button. It's going to be great. Hey, the, seriously, though, the coaches will eat this up, won't they? Yeah, no question. Uh, the frustration of coaches when you ask the player, you know, who are you playing this week? Did you see them play? Oh, no, I couldn't. You know, I couldn't get on telly. Now, no, no excuses. So for all those blokes out there playing AFL footy, you must watch the game coming up. And you must watch the game before. You mightn't like what Rizzi, you see from the game before when I'm you play them. I'm telling you, the players will be hitting the delete button as much <laughs> as they hit the record button. I'll tell you right now. There'll be things they don't like. Well, the coaches will pick them up during the week. Don't worry about that. <laughs> and there's some things they might like not like hearing as well from the commentary because we're going to call it absolutely as we see it. But to back up our credentials, have a look at this. This is the tail of the tape of those calling the action on the Fox Footy Channel. Eight Hall of Famers, 46 All-Australians, 30 Best and Fairest, 24 premierships, 4,641 goals, a fair few of those yours, Jase, and 3,975 games. That's a pretty good tale of the tape, as I said. Add to that, Dwayne Russell, a bloke who's made the jump from being a gun footballer into being one of the great sports commentators of our time, to Anthony Hudson, who just brings the real feel, as we heard there when he called that magnificent goal by Nick Davis in that preliminary final. And, of course, Matty Campbell, who not only knows everything about the odds, has played the game himself and has been a stalwart of the Fox footy channel. They're fantastic people. They're going to bring you the game, ladies and gentlemen. They're your voice, they're your eyes. and ears. handball, almost got away with it, Elton. Kick going. Lights put it through. They're back in front. That's just the pace of White. Good centre clearance. Hawks won the tap. But uh, it was Richmond that got the ball clear. And we'll get another one. What do you think, Kingy? I think they can. I think the Delidio is so important to this side. This is a performance right here in front of us now without Cochin, Martin and Rewald. 